thank you for joining our session on sponsored display. My name is Saurav Singh, and I'm a product manager on the sponsored display team. So my goal today is to make sure that I take you through what sponsored display is and how it can help you reach and engage shoppers both on and off Amazon. So why use sponsored display? When we look at the purchase journey, shoppers typically take time to consider different available product options before making a final purchase decision. Based on Amazon Insights, only 4% of shoppers convert to a purchase in the same session where they started browsing for a product. This means 96% of shoppers take time to consider the different options available to them. Typically, shoppers take around six to seven days to make a purchase decision. And on average, they browse through about 14 different product detail pages before they make that purchase. So what does all this mean for you? It means that browsing and discovery is an important part of the shopper's purchase journey. And it can take them some time while they are doing it. And during this phase, you should consider reaching and engaging shoppers with your relevant product offerings. So there are four key business objectives across the product lifecycle where sponsored display can help you. There's product awareness as you launch a new product and want more shoppers to be aware of your offering. Then there's customer acquisition for you to reach shoppers who are considering similar products. We have got brand loyalty for you to continue engaging audiences who have already purchased from you. And finally, remarketing, where you can re-engage audiences who have already looked at your product, but have not yet purchased it. So now that we know of these key objectives, let's first look at product awareness. For product awareness, your aim is to maximize your reach to relevant shoppers. Sponsored display helps you achieve this goal by enabling you to target relevant product categories on Amazon. In this case, the toy manufacturer can target the category of plush toys to help drive awareness. This will enable the toy manufacturer to show Baby Yoda toys on the product detail pages of all of these plus toy products and therefore maximize their reach. You can further refine this targeting by using additional filters like brand, price, prime eligibility. Next, let's look at the use case of customer acquisition. Sponsored display can help you in this objective by engaging customers who are considering similar or complementary products. You can either use product targeting to target the detail pages of such similar products, or through the audiences option, uh, you can engage shoppers who have viewed, browsed, or purchased similar products. In our case, the toy manufacturer can target the detail page of Star Wars or superhero themed building blocks, for an example, to reach new customers. Next up is brand loyalty. You can also use sponsored display to continue engaging your loyal customer who are already browsing through your offerings. Through product targeting on your own detail pages, you can use multiple ad slots to showcase your other related products and ensure that shoppers who are considering one of your products also consider your other offerings either as a substitute or as a complement. Again, in our example, the seller can showcase their new toy through sponsored display ad on the detail page of their Baby Yoda themed t-shirt, as there is a very high likelihood that shoppers interested in such a t-shirt may also be interested in the toy. And finally, what about remarketing? Well, the force is strong with this one. Using sponsored display audiences option, you can re-engage audiences who have already engaged with your product but have not yet purchased the product. For example, our toy seller can re-engage such shoppers who have viewed the Baby Yoda toy, but
but have not yet purchased it. And they can do so through the views remarketing option within audiences. With that, thank you, and I hope you all enjoyed this session and found it very useful. Thanks again, and have a great day.